where do I start? <laughs> Somewhere along the traps I saw this application for a grant of something. I'm going for $20,000. Never usually go for grants because there's just too much work involved and I'm a little bit lazy. However, $20,000 is a lot of money and I thought it might be worthwhile jumping through the hoops and my end goal is to make my show really, really, really good. It's due on Monday and today is Saturday. I've been picking at it and picking at it and picking at it like all the tricks, like getting nowhere. But you've got to start, so the whole point of this was to perform the show in particular festivals like the Edinburgh Fringe, Adelaide Fringe Festival, to really get it out there. Looking at the Edinburgh Fringe and it, there's a thing about music and um, the rights for music and I just went, oh, that's right. You've got to pay all the royalty fees and all those sorts of things and it almost works out cheaper to bring a musician with you to do the music. It reminded me of this time I was in the circus and I was doing the act with a violinist and it was a great act, it was, it was, it was really cool. But what happened right at the start of the act is the musician's radio mic just died, just died in the arse. We're in this 1300 seat tent, the venue, it's a, a big circus tent. they're loud, they're talking. Anyway, the audience just, just was so quiet, were well, whisper quiet. Like, you could have heard a pin drop at this time while I'm on stage and the violin is playing and the audience was just so hushed and you could feel them leaning forward, just, just wanting to hear the music, wanting to hear what's going on as well as see what's going on. And that just made me think that it's, it's so special, um, like you can get carried away with all the mics and the amps and good sound and all of those sorts of things, but at the same time, if you strip it all back, strip it bare to just a, an unmodified acoustic instrument and it just has such a crazy impact. I, I still remember being horrified though, it's like, oh no, the violin's not working, oh it's so quiet, oh, and then the band, when the band kicks in for their part, they were just very low as well, keeping it. It was so great. It was something, there's something so great about everyone seeing that something's gone horribly wrong and just changing everything to work with what's there. And that's just, that's what I love about the circus is that things can go horribly wrong, but it's okay because everyone's right there with you. That's all. <laughs> 
hope you're well.